A Kansas teen recovering after being hit by a car. Uh, she says the person who did it was driving distracted, and she's now warning others to put down the phone. KSN's Derek Lytle shares her story in our top story, Derek. Jeff, Julia Violet Etzel tells me she had different plans for her campus high senior skip day other than recovering from an accident. She says she hopes drivers take her advice and put their phones down. Violet Etzel was leaving her afternoon job at Rex Elementary Thursday. Almost through the crosswalk and this car just comes and like hits me straight through my right side. Shock set in. I was just sitting there shaking, like I called my dad. The driver who hit her stopped to help. Edsold spent hours in the ER waiting to find out the extent of her injuries. I have a bruised uh, right lung and then two cracked ribs. Barely even walk at first. I had to have people kind of help me walk because it just hurt really bad. And the teen's father says this is every parent's nightmare. As long as I don't get a fo that phone call, you know, it's a good day and you know, yesterday was a bad day. We got that call. He says his daughter followed all the proper safety precautions, something that concerns him even more. You know, you try to teach him to do the right thing and obey the rules as a either a pedestrian or a, a bike rider. And, you know, when they do what they're supposed to and they still get hurt, you know, that's really disappointing. Violet wants the accident to be a message to drivers that that call or text message can wait. Just don't use your phone when you drive. I mean, like accidents happen all the time and just just don't it's just you can always check it later police tell me the driver who hit violet was given a citation while that accident happened in hayesville wichita police say they have seen an increase in crashes involving pedestrians compared to last year here for you derek lytle ksn news 3.